Thank you, Kenza. Thank you for making such a complex topic easier to understand. And now we would like to welcome Faisal Qureshi of RWA. His topic is Fever, a virtual reality headset. Hello, everyone. My name is Faisal Qureshi. I'm from Raffles World Academy, and I am here to talk about my invention. So I'd like to start off by asking you all a question. Have you ever thought of this while working that I just don't want to do this anymore? I want to go out, have fun, just have adventures and whatnot. Well, don't you hate it when that happens and you just can't go around? Well, I hate that as well. So I researched a lot and I found a solution to it. Virtual reality. Now, what is virtual reality? Virtual reality can be described in the two words literally by itself virtual and reality. Virtual means something very close to real life, but in a computerized format, and reality, which means something as, that we, as humans, experience in our lives. So a very good example of this was developed by Oculus using their Oculus Rift. Now, what is the Oculus Rift? The Oculus Rift is a virtual reality headset to fit all your 3D immersive needs. So when you put this on, you feel as if you're actually there, as if you're in a zoo or underwater skiing or whatnot. What but here comes the tricky part. Everything good comes for a very good price. And this is also a part of that. I hated that. I wanted to make something that was equally had the same features as a virtual reality headset, except it was more affordable to human mankind. So I went out, made many prototypes, and thus I failed. I learned from my failures, and finally, I made my first ever working prototype. Bring in the headset. Gentlemen, this is Fever, a virtual reality headset to give you all your 3D needs. So this that you see is the first ever proto working prototype. So let's start off by telling you that why would you want to buy this? Why not anything else? So first of all, normal virtual reality headsets cost about $400, while as in Fever, it would cost less than $25. And that is already 16 times less in cost. Now, let's talk about how these things work. So this thing uses a 3D viewing feature called side by side to imitate a 3D experience. As you can see, these two images, if you look in through this, you will, it will combine those two images and it will make you feel as if you're actually there. Moving on to these lenses. So, what are these lenses? These lenses are spherical lenses, and these work by, if you just look into them, and if they're placed at the exact position, they will give you an immersive 3D experience. But if it's not, it could even damage your eyes. So we need to be really careful about that. Now, how is this thing built? So this thing is built out of foam, which is a material that, which is very common among all of you guys. But, and I chose foam mainly because I wanted to make an affordable headset and an amazing competitor was cardboard, a material called cardboard and I didn't use that mainly because if you put it against your head you'll start feeling headaches and your head will start to itch a lot and so that's why I chose foam because it's a lot more comfortable now if you can see in the start in the front there is Velcro, which is to hold your screen in. Now, what is the screen? The screen is your lovely little smartphone. Now, why the smartphone? Because I wanted to make an affordable headset again, and because it has its amazing gyroscopic and accelerometric features, it becomes the best device to fit into your fever headset. Now. I'd like to answer a question 
to you guys. Do I have any future plans? Yes, of course I do. Three of them, actually. First one being, I want to host a website which will explain all of its features into, into the internet so I can gain more popularity over there and I can thus increase my research product. Second, after a few more prototyping and adding new features, I like Fever to be in the market. And lastly, I like to launch an app which will discuss all of Fever's features and abilities. Thank you.